Hey everyone, it's Aisha. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a really quick video just on how I do my um, winged liner. Uh, a couple of you guys requested it. I usually wear um, winged liner like every single day, so I figured that I would just go ahead and show you guys how I do my winged liner. So whenever I do tutorials and stuff, I can just refer back to this um, video. Okay, so the products I'm using, or the product I'm using to create this winged liner. L'Oreal's um, yeah, Liner Intense in Carbon Black and the applicator... Sorry, my nose is itchy. The applicator just looks like... It looks like this. I'm just gonna zoom you guys in so you can see better and I'll show you guys how I do my winged liner. So I'm gonna take my... Um, my liquid liner. I'm gonna try my best to stay in the frame. Okay, so first I just like to um, place the um, applicator just on here and go as close to your lash line as possible. So just kind of rest the applicator on your lash line and just let it slide. Okay, and once you've got that, you're just gonna... I like to um, just start off like that and then work my way to the inner corner and then do the winged liner instead of opposite. So I'll just show you guys. And I start off really, really thin uh, towards the inner and then it slowly gets thicker as it builds out to the end. So in um, small little strokes, just slowly make your way into the center or into the inner corner. And then once you get to about right here, you just go, so this whole time I was going over the lash line, now I'm gonna go under, and then I'm just gonna finish off that inner corner. Just like that. So once you've got that line, you can go over it one more time just to like, um, make it a little more darker. You can go as thick as you want or as thin as you want. I personally like it really thin and then it goes out thicker towards the wing. Now we're gonna start making the wing. So for the wing, you're just going to put your um, finger, your pinky finger like this, and you're gonna rest it on your cheek. And you are gonna take the applicator and just put it where the outer, um, like the outest corner right here. And you're just gonna follow this um, curve all the way up, like till about right there. Okay, so once you've got that line, you're just gonna connect this line with the end of that. Just like that, and now you're just gonna fill it all in. Okay, and there you've got your winged liner. So you can fix it up if you want. You can make the line a little longer or um, a little more thicker at the end. I'm just going to do my other eye and I'll be right back. Okay, so my lighting just got really weird, so just um, ignore that. So once I've got the winged liner on both sides, you're gonna wanna make sure they are both symmetrical. A way you can do that is just always start off like right in here. So put your felt applicator right there and then just bring it up. And that'll guarantee you um, the perfect symmetrical uh, liner on both eyes. Okay, so that's how I do my winged liner. Um, I'm just going to put on mascara very quick. Okay, so that is how I do my winged liner. Um, it looks like that. And I think I did it pretty good today. Uh, usually sometimes I won't do it as um, I guess winged as this. Sometimes I'll just do like a little mini winged liner which you guys will see in some of my tutorials. But for the most part this is how I like to do my winged liner and um, just for the heck of it I put on some red lipstick just to go with it because I find liquid liner and mascara and then red lips is just such a bold look and I love doing that. And for my red lips if you guys were wondering I'm just wearing Wet n Wild. Wet n Wild and 
I don't know what, I think it's red velvet, it doesn't say on here, it just says um, 910D. But it's just this really bright bluish toned red, and it looks like that, and I'm just wearing that today. And I love doing red lips, um, so yeah, I love this. Uh, so yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed my um, winged liner tutorial, and I hope it was actually helpful to you guys. I'm still getting the hang of doing tutorials, but I hope I'll get better, and I hope you guys really liked it. And don't forget to um, comment on this video telling me uh, what you guys liked about the video, uh, what I could improve, or any requests that you guys want me to do as well. And yeah, just uh, like this video if you guys want more tutorials, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye! Oh my god. <laughs> I just caught that on camera. <laughs>